Thanks for joining us. I'm Kate Merrill with this WBZ News Update. Our top stories today, we've learned the 15-year-old who was shot and killed in Dorchester was Curtis Ashford. His mother tells WBZ he was out playing basketball with friends last night when he was shot. Police have not made any arrests yet. Law firm Morgan & Morgan says they've been hired by MBTA passengers who were hurt during last week's fire on the Orange Line. Law firm says it will work to see if there were any safety precautions which failed. Governor Charlie Baker signed the state's budget. It includes money to make the MBTA safer, help for domestic violence programs, and youth violence prevention. The governor also added in some parts of his criminal reform package that lawmakers have refused to take up. Let's get a check of your forecast on this Thursday. Dave Epstein is here and Dave, it's a muggy day. It is a muggy day out there, Kate, no doubt about it. We've got some building clouds and underneath these clouds could be a few showers. It seems like when we get these droughts like this, when the showers start going over the drought area, they actually tend to fall apart. So I am not optimistic that you're going to see much rain, but we're going to leave it in the forecast here later on this afternoon. Another chance for showers overnight tonight. So when you get up tomorrow morning, the ground may be wet. Uh, temperatures tonight down into the 70s after being in the 80s this afternoon, about 86, 87 degrees. There's that bump up in our chance of precip here. It's going to be warm and muggy. You'll need the air conditioners tonight for sure. And tomorrow, low 90s uh, north of Boston, right around 90 around Boston. You can see it's a very warm day tomorrow. So do not underestimate the heat that's coming up. Uh, and then we may see another round of showers tomorrow night. That will lead us into the weekend. And boy, the weekend? Yeah, it's, uh, I gotta say, I think it's just basically a 10, Kate. I mean, mostly sunny skies, mid 80s, and low humidity. Does it get much nicer? Yeah, it's pretty nice. You gotta make sure you have good outdoor plans. So it's a lot of pressure, Dave. All right, thanks. I'm Kate Merrill. This has been a WBZ News Update. Have a great day.